Alrighty, yo, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen, Fane here, welcome back to another video, boys. Today we are back on the Fake Cloud Network for a brand new Dungeons Let's Play. And guys, today's episode is going to be insane. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys a very good method on how to make souls on the server. But before we go ahead and get into the video, the winner of the Monte Cray giveaway will be up on the screen right now. And in today's video, we're going to go ahead and give away 2,000 clouds to one of you lucky people. So if you guys want to go ahead and enter, drop a like, comment your IGN, and you guys entered. Good luck to everybody entering in. And guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into the video i'll see you guys in the next clip and peace out Alrighty, boys so as i said in today's video we're going to go ahead and show you guys an insane method on how to make souls and if you guys don't know what souls are used for they're basically used for enchants on the server so yeah, it is a very big thing and i mean i'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to make an insane amount of them in a little bit but before we go ahead and do that we've got two multi guys to go ahead and open up of course we open up to every single episode so yeah let's go ahead and see what we're going to go ahead and get from these and um hopefully some good stuff we just got ourselves a legendary gems pouch a legendary cube box alrighty we've got the vile chest plate we've got a legendary soul pouch 2.5x soul booster we've got a legendary cube box legendary gem pouch a souls pouch and then also another cube box i'll go ahead and take that that's actually a pretty decent amount of pouches let's go ahead and open up the final one though and um this is actually going to go ahead and come in very handy this soul booster because you know this video we're going to go ahead and show you guys how to make an insane amount of souls and this booster is going to go ahead and help out a lot so yeah, that is very good that we got another one of these actually so we've got two of them now and um, we've got a few more more pouches and stuff like that let's go to open up the pouches real quick and hopefully we can go ahead and get some good stuff there we go we'll go to quickly just spam those open and let's go ahead and see what we get Alrighty, we've got 53,000 gems 119,000 gems we've got 27 million 29 million and 13 million souls which is very good we're sitting at 84 million souls now and that uh, we can go ahead and probably upgrade our soul grade a little bit so let's go ahead and actually do that right now there we go plop 500 levels on that but ladies and gentlemen let's go ahead and get straight into the video we're gonna go ahead and type slash warps and let's go Go ahead and go to the solo world and um, i've actually been doing a bit of grinding off camera we ended up doing a stream we've done some grinding over there as well we are now prestige three with kraken rank and kraken rank is a pretty damn expensive rank um so yeah we've done a bit of grinding we, you know we've upgraded our sword enchants a bit as you guys can see um we've got a few enchants actually max out so we've got the hawk eye enchant max out and also the critical enchant max out which is very good and then we bought some levels of gem grade and then some soul grade and also some salt magnet and yeah that's basically all the enchants that we have on our sword but yeah let's go ahead and quickly go down here and i'm gonna go ahead and get straight into the soul making method it is actually insanely overpowered and i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how it works so basically guys you want to go ahead and be able to one hit mobs and that is the best way to go ahead and make souls on the server i don't know how it works but every single time you kill a mob it gives you some sort of souls i'm not exactly sure on it, like where it comes from or anything like that but boys i tested this out and it actually works and i'm um, saying so you want to go ahead and upgrade your sword good enough to be able to one hit a mob and if you aren't able to go ahead and one hit a mob then go ahead and go down one dungeon so that you can go ahead and do that and as you guys can see our souls are going up significantly which is very good and this is what i mean like this is an insane soul making method and now let's go ahead and go down to a dungeon where i am not able to go ahead and one hit a mob and i'll show you guys the difference so as you guys saw before we we're making so much souls um and now it's going to go ahead and slow down a bit like we're not going to be able to make much um besides like the soul greed enchant that procs like yeah we're making a little bit but we're making a lot more when we're one hitting the mobs before so yeah that is the difference between one hitting mobs and not one hitting mobs definitely one hitting mobs makes you a lot more souls which is what we're going to go ahead and do in today's episode for a bit so yeah let's go ahead and go back down here where we are able to go ahead and one hit the mobs i want to go ahead and farm some souls for a bit you know upgrade my sorting chance and then later on we'll go ahead and go down there to go ahead and focus on money so that we can go ahead and prestige so on and so forth and so yeah boys i'm going to go ahead and grind here for a bit you know stack up on my souls maybe upgrade my enchants maybe not i might just go ahead and save up everything and just upgrade it on camera um i don't know yet but yeah this is basically what our sword is looking like so i'll go to show you guys my sword in the next clip if i decide to go ahead and upgrade you know the enchants with my souls um so yeah we'll go ahead and check back on that and see you know how far we've come with the enchants on the sword and uh, if not we'll go ahead and obviously show you guys our souls balance and stuff like that and upgrade everything on camera and as you guys can see we just made eight million souls in only one minute worth of grinding which is very good um considering like the eco of the server and stuff like that like 8 million souls is a decent amount to be making per minute and um so yeah boys i think i'm gonna go ahead and cut the clip right here though we're gonna go ahead and do a bunch of grinding you know stack up on our souls and either upgrade the enchants off camera or we'll go ahead and bring guys back with the souls and then we'll go ahead and upgrade together but yeah guys for right now we're gonna go ahead and do a bit of grinding and i'll go ahead and bring you all right back later on Alex, right 
Alrighty guys, we've been grinding for about 3 hours now, which honestly isn't too long considering we got almost 2 billion souls in the balance. And yeah, I did not end up spending all my souls so that we can go ahead and do it on camera with you guys. But you guys, I want to go ahead and show you guys one thing before we go ahead and spend it. Let's go ahead and do such belt up souls. And keep in mind, this was only like 3 hours worth of grinding at maximum. Um, I'd probably say about like 2.5 hours to be exact, but let's say 3 hours to be safe. Anyways, let's go do such belt up. And as you guys can see we are number eight on the entire server for souls and i'm um, literally only like three hours worth of grinding so yeah boys this method is insane so yeah boys let's go ahead and spend all of our souls there i think i'm gonna go ahead and try and max out a bunch of inch hats. as you guys can see soul greed is already maxed out let's go ahead and try and max out gem greed um and we'll go ahead and do this there we go and then buy 500 levels there we go that is a lot of orbs gone right there or souls um but yeah we've got gem greed max out now soul greed is maxed out i don't know how soul greed is only 3,000 levels to max out uh, but yeah, now we got greed to go ahead and max out. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. And um, now that greed is maxed out, we got three of the main enchants basically fully maxed out. Let's go ahead and see what else we can go ahead and max out. I actually want to go ahead and buy a few levels of a lucky enchant. This gives you crate keys while you're grinding. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. And then buy another 500 levels of that. There we go. And um, that is basically all of our souls gone right there. But L sword is looking very good. We got some very good enchants on it. But guys, I think it is time to go ahead ahead and prestige once again i want to go ahead and get the prestige four as there is actually a few benefits that you get with it so let's go ahead and go down here first and then uh, we'll go ahead and spend some of our money on some pet eggs so that we can go ahead and have some good multiplier pets and as you guys can see we're going to go ahead and buy some cave pets and they cost 1.5 q each we've got 65 q in the balance so yeah we can go ahead and buy a few of these bad boys let's go ahead and do that and um the minimum multiplier you can get is a 20x and the maximum is an 80x which is very good and um if we go ahead and quickly do such pets as you guys can see i mean our maximum is a 20x right now so yeah we're getting some pretty insane pets as you guys can see let's go ahead and unequip all this stuff there we go we'll go ahead and equip the best ones and there we go yo our freaking pets are looking stacked up right now let's go ahead and maybe buy one more 9x and we'll go ahead and see what we can go ahead and get from this um and then after that we'll go ahead and prestige and show you guys what benefits we get from it so yeah there we go we opened up all of them and then um, we got another 50x let's go ahead and do this do this do this there we go 50x 40x and then another 30x there we go and yeah we got a total of i'm pretty sure over a 200x just off of our pets so yeah that is very good we're going to be making a lot more money but guys i think it is time to go ahead and hit a such prestige let's go ahead and do that and there we go we lost everything once again but that is fine we are now prestige full for 20x multiplier and on top of that if we go ahead and right click onto our sword we go to the potential cubes we just unlock this right over here so we can go ahead and put a another cube onto our sword and then we got a bunch of these bad boys to go and open up so let me go and open up all these legendary cube boxes and i'll go ahead and bring you guys back with the best ones that we get Alrighty, guys and after opening up all those cube boxes i'm pretty sure this is the best one that we got which is 118 percent soul boost and it has a 53 percent chance of working so hopefully it does work um, but guys it's gonna go ahead and give us an additional 1.1x boost of souls um, and it's gonna be permanent so yeah that is very good let's go ahead and try and see if it works and oh my god it did not work okay i need to go and find the other one uh, i'm pretty sure i got like 112 percent somewhere here there we go let's go to see if this works and there we go that one actually worked which is very good now we got a damage boost and a souls boost on our sword which is very good let's go to do such booster and see if i updated in there as well and um yeah there we go as you guys can see 3.12x and um once we go ahead and activate this as well 2.5x added to that we're gonna have like a 5.6x soul boost which is gonna be insane and um yeah we're gonna be able to make a 
a lot of souls just off of farming. But guys, I want to go ahead and hit at least Prestige 5 before ending off this video. So we're going to go ahead and do such warps once again. Let's go to the solo world and we're going to go ahead and do a bit more grinding. Let's go ahead and do Ender Chest and grab one of these boosters here. As you guys can see, we've got a 2000x money booster, which is going to be making us a lot of money. So let's go ahead and redeem this, redeem this. There we go. And then we'll go ahead and start killing these chickens. And guys, if you guys didn't know, you can do this souls method with literally any dungeon that you're at. Like even if you're at the beginner one, you can go ahead and do it. All you need to go ahead and do is just upgrade your sword that you, so that you can go ahead and one hit them. And that's what we're going to go ahead and do right now. So let's go to get the 13 million real quick so that we can go ahead and upgrade. There we go. And um, yeah, it is literally the exact same as you guys can see. We're still one hitting them and we're going to be making the same amount of orbs as we were before. And um, you guys will go ahead and see that. As you guys can see, our orbs are updating or else souls, I should say. I'm, I've been playing too much prison, bro. I literally keep calling it orbs. But yeah, boys, it literally works anywhere. Let's go ahead and do such rank up and let's go ahead and go to the next one. And um, as I said, I want to go ahead and hit prestige five before the end of this episode. So that's what we're going to go ahead and aim for. We're going to go ahead and do a little bit more grinding before ending up this episode. And so hey guys, I'm gonna go ahead and do some grinding. Let's go ahead and get to 1Q so that we are able to go ahead and prestige the prestige 5 and I'll go ahead and bring you all right back. Alrighty guys, we've been grinding for a bit now. We got 1.8 quintillion in the balance, which means that we have enough money to go ahead and prestige. But before we go ahead and do that, I'm gonna go ahead and buy some pets. And um, yeah, we are currently at the candy pet section and let's go ahead and check these out. The lowest one is a 60x multiplier and then the highest one is 180x. So let's go ahead ahead and open up three of these right now and then we'll be, have enough money to go ahead and open up another one so we'll go ahead and do that and um yeah we've got two cookies we've got a chocolate and let's go ahead and open up our final one before we go ahead and prestige and um we just got ourselves a gummy i'm pretty sure the gummy one is actually pretty good um yeah it's actually pretty good it's 80x let's go ahead and switch pets real quick and we'll go ahead and actually put all of these on so let's go ahead and do this there we go and then we'll go ahead and spam these there we go and um yeah the lowest pet we got is a 50x and then the highest one is an 80x which is very good we got almost like a 300x multiplier just off of pets currently so yeah that is awesome but guys i think we're going to go ahead and hit a prestige now so let's go ahead and do that and there we go we are officially prestige 5 now with a 40x multiplier let's go and see have we unlocked any new enchants let's go to quickly just check and um i don't think we, actually i'm pretty sure we unlocked this enchant or the Inferno intro, because I know for a fact that at Prestige 5, you unlock some enchants. I don't know which ones. I'm pretty sure it was actually the Infernal one. But guys, before we go ahead and end off the episode, I want to go ahead and do a 200 million coin flip with my souls that I have. So basically, an all-in. Let's go ahead and create this. There we go. 200 million souls CF. And hopefully, we can go ahead and win this. So at the start of the next episode, we can go ahead and upgrade the Infernal um, enchanters. And yeah, let's go ahead and see. And um, yeah, hopefully, once again, we can go ahead and win this. And there we go. We just won ourselves 400 million orbs ggs bro and um there we go we got 391 million orbs in the balance now so yeah in the next episode we can go ahead and upgrade the infernal enchant but guys we actually did get 80 lucky crate keys from grinding as well so let's go and open up all this and um we just got ourselves a bunch of gems and souls that's actually very good and we got five master keys let's go and open up that and then we got 35 elite crate keys let's go and open up all this as well oh wait never mind it doesn't even bulk open let's go and just do this quickly and um see what type of stuff we can go ahead and get and boom there we go we just opened up all that we got a bunch of pouches let's go ahead and open these up there we go and we got a few boosts as well gems boosts we got some soul boosts that's actually very good and uncommon souls pouches let's go ahead and just spam these open as well see what we can go ahead and get and um we just got ourselves a bunch of souls that is very good we are sitting at 460 million souls now and over 3 million gems which is insane but guys i think we're going to go ahead and end off the episode there thank you so much for tuning in to today's episode boys if you guys enjoyed please go ahead and drop a like make sure you guys sub to my channel if you guys are new and i'll see you guys for a brand new video in the next few days and peace out